part of this situation where uh, suspected cases of police abuse of their powers uh, leads to public pressure. There is an ad hoc uh, arrangement instituted to look into that specific instance of uh, suspected police conduct. And then we go back to business as usual. That is certainly not uh, the way I see things. I'm talking about having an, an institution that is uh, specifically mandated to look into such cases where, I mean, at least citizens will have another avenue to which they can lodge complaints about police uh, suspected abuse of their, of their authority. And so if cases like this happen, we would expect that that institution would automatically deal with that. But if your question has to do with, in this specific instance, should we be having some external um, investigation or so? That really, I, I, I don't know, because I don't think it is, um, it is the way to deal with the, the issue at heart. And the issue here is to have an, an institutional arrangement in which, yes, we have internal mechanisms to ensure that there is effective supervision, there is accountability for how police uh, use their resources, supervise, investigate cases, and so forth, but also an external body that is able to um, uh, provide another layer of accountability. And I think that's what we should be aiming for, rather than specific instances asking for external investigations, those investigations are done, they never really produce any meaningful uh, so, uh, uh, change. 